Generally, I prefer the book, but I can think of one big exception, and that's The Wizard of Oz, which is fabulous as a movie. I guess I prefer the real world. Writers make our characters suffer, and in the real world, the suffering doesn't come quite as hard and fast because our job is to torment the reader. So I think I prefer to live in the real world and spend a lot of time in the fictional world. It depends on the world that I would be in and the sort of ogre or dragon I was encountering. The dragons of Ursula Le Guin I would love to spend some time with. I would love to see moments in the past when breakthroughs are made, like when somebody figured out agriculture. So I think I would like to go back to the very, very distant past when the germs of the present are just forming. I already have no sugar. And I am infatuated with caffeine, so that's easy. It would have been the city, but now I live in Brewster, New York. And I live in a very, very beautiful old farmhouse with a wonderful backyard with very old trees. And I would be hard pressed to choose between, but I think I like living where I live. Mountains. I like to move, I like to walk, I like to walk uphill, so it would be mountains. I'm not a mother, but I see that that would be like choosing among children. They both hold books, so geez, they're both great. These are hard. I mean, the pleasure of a book is that somebody else has done all the work, but the pleasure of writing is the discovery that goes with it. So um, I guess I'd rather write. They both are curses that deprive one of the power of choice. And I guess, again, I'd have to come out on the side of defiance. But having to be defiant, it seems to me, uh, forces one always to be angry. And I don't think I would like that very much. I would rather be a, an ogre than a squirrel, because I kind of see that as the choice between being the villain, and villains are really interesting, and being the victim. Villains have a lot of choice, and they may not do well in the end, but they generally have a pretty good ride along the way.